like it would be done and we, would, we wouldn't have a stream set to come up next. So yeah. like, <laughs> no matter what, it's going on stream. Yeah. <laughs> All right, but I'm sorry, I got stuck in the narrative there. We, we're already into it now between Pokepan and Nano Ash. Yep. Uh, Pokepan honestly has been having a really good performance this tournament. I feel like um, when Pokemon yeah. really when Pokemon comes through and is sealing it, like they will just like destroy everyone. Yeah. Yeah, and, and honestly, when Pokemon shows up, like yeah. <laughs> everyone was nervous that like after the the sheer amount of DQs that we saw from everyone everyone else, else that they're like Pokemon's probably next. Yeah. But it's funny because I asked Pokemon, and they were like. Oh, I actually came because I knew everyone was expecting me not to. <laughs> I was like, oh, I have to come. I came to spite the haters. Yeah, I love that attitude. Exactly. <laughs> All right, offstage Unchula resets the stage control, oh, but... Oh. Back here is a good idea, just kind of mistimed it a little bit. Yeah. Okay, now you're on ledge versus Bowser. Have fun. Touching the up tilt forward air. Interesting. Yeah, those down airs have been working out for Buckman quite a bit, too. I didn't see that, but... Okay. Then first stock, we've got a classic next hit kill situation. Did that... Oh, it did. Oh, never I mind. almost thought okay. it did. Yeah. Now actually next hit kills, though. <laughs> wow, up air from ledge once again, but yep. this time around, Nanowash is ready for it and is able to punish. Yes. Alright, let's see if Nanowash can hold on to the advantage here, but really, it just seems like Pokemon needs to get dialed in on execution for, like, these hard punishes off stage because i mean so far it's been the right idea just like slight misses here and there that should have taken stock yeah but wow huge tech chase follow for nano ash there with that down smash mm -hmm. yep got nano ash kind of picking picking his spots to go in really really well mm -hmm. well with the call out there Jeez. saying and I, you're you're gonna run out nano ash di'd that correctly too like holding directly out that should keep you away from that back here but Pokemon waited a little longer to throw out the back air and just track them all the way out. Yeah. Go, Pokemon. Oh, trying to go for the Nair Trains a little bit. Oh, yeah. going for it again. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, good wait there to kind of see what if Nanoash had picked any option and yeah. to, to air to air win with the neutral air there. That was nice. And see right there is Nanoash's like mobility in the corner again. Where he just kind of says, you're trying to corner me, but if I keep moving enough, like, you're going to be scared to corner me too much because then I can I still whip me. True. Yeah. But... Yeah, another another well placed forward air from yeah. Nano Ash that we've just been seeing time and time again on stream. Yeah. Just like when you have the one tool that works. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Again, early pulls for these down tilt two frame attempts from Pokepen, but I'm sure he'll get dialed in pretty Whoa. deep here for those. Landing up air. Ooh, into the side B. That was a clean combo. Yeah, that was a lot of percent too. Yeah. Essentially a zero to fifty. Yeah. Oh, the parry, very clean. Nano Ash kind of like tightening up his defense quite a lot. Oh, oh flame wow. Breath. Yeah. Pokemon just kind of ducking underneath it though. Is that? No. No, not yet. But should be able to seal it up, honestly. Okay. Side B for Yeah, mine. obviously switching up the timing on the down tilt attempts for those two frames, but still. It's not working out. That's oh, damage you gotta eat too from that teleport recovery. Yeah. Nano Ash in a really, really good spot here. And up being the ledge drop down there from Pokemon. Yeah, gonna damage. catch Bowser. Oh no! So one time it worked and the next time it just didn't. Yeah. I know that Bowser had this weird, like, I think armor or invulnerability on a feed when you contest from above. So yeah. you actually have to hit, like, from a slight horizontal to. Right. Oh, jeez. Now it's just waited. Really just waited. Like, uh -huh, yes, but have you forgotten my forward air? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, go ahead and show me that you're going to go into the air a couple yeah. times and then now I'll throw out the forward air. Yeah, Bowser forward air with from Nano Ash is kind of reminiscent of like the Ike Nair. It's just like, yes, I will just use the one tool, and the entire game revolves around how you deal with the one tool. Exactly. And once you deal with the one tool, I will change the way I use the <laughs> <Exactly>. one tool. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's a lot of the time it is it is about that simple kind of rock rip zoom when it comes to Nano Ash's yep. gameplay. Like, and it's just a rotation of like so oh. effective with the use of his tools. Uh huh. But all right, smaller stage to work with this time around. I like this pound, a counter pick for Pokepen because, yeah. I mean, even if you mess up on your advantage state, like executions, Ooh. a lot of the time your opponent stays in disadvantage uh, if they choose like the like a, a laggy option, like air dodging out of disadvantage or something like that too. Like you can just continue following up anyways. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I'm wondering if this game too, we're gonna see that like monstrous adaptation from Pokepen that we saw when they were fighting Quandarius. 
where it's like game one looks pretty decisive for their opponent and then game two they just stomp true like, yeah. yeah it's just on it like i've said it before just a couple minutes ago but it just feels like execution right now for pokey yeah i'm just looking for them to get dialed in obviously a lot more opportunities to ledge trap which were kind of the the flopping moments for pokey ben before yeah. uh, on a small stage like this now though i mean both of them having to deal with a lot more ledge play. Yeah, for sure. Oh, drop down there. Kind of good avoidance by Nano Ash. Ooh. Spaced very well. Contesting with the up air. That was crazy. Yeah. Yep, the grab. No back here. Yep, Not good DI time, from, yeah. Yeah, from Nano Ash. Okay. Ooh, good air dodge. Going nice. deep. Yeah. Okay, we'll finally take it off the side there. I mean, yeah. maybe it's just simplifying the game plan, just getting your damage with neutral air. Reset and repeat it. Oh, jeez. That was almost a scary moment where you're like, is he taking them off stage? I, it almost felt like Pokemon was trying to take them both off stage. Yeah, that actually would make sense given the given the stocks and percentages. Yeah, get him to like kill himself. I don't know. Yeah. And we're seeing Pokemon make use of like the down tilt two frame, which has actually been working several times. Because um, after that, you know, it pops you up, pops you up into the forward air or the back air. Oh, there's that back air that I've been looking for. And yeah. another one will. Not seen on the stock yet, but still, this should be it. Yeah, yeah. that was like a shift. We haven't seen Pokepen start going for those drop down backwards yet. So that yeah. when he knew when he knew it's like it's time. He was I'm just like to... missing the first few times that we were seeing it, but this yeah. time around, it's, it's working out. I think it's just more of an effect of just being dialed in now. All right, but early percent combos. This should be pretty freaking yeah. big, especially with the platform extension. But did maybe... Nano Ash SDI down into it the It almost. Platform? I was gonna say that. I feel like Nano Ash, Nano Ash is trying to DI or SDI down to get onto that platform. Nano Ash taking his time in the corner. Mm -hmm. Oh, no grab. Wow, oh. both of them with grabbing, but Nano Ash getting away with even just the jabs there to get some advantage. Ooh. Kick back here. Yeah, wow. Okay, down air, forward air. <laughs> I like the usage of down air by Pokemon. Like, it's a, a niche tool when it comes to pilots who like Tana can play, and you yes. can get a lot. It's a combo starter. Like, you can get grabs at low percent off of it or yes. a back air like we just saw. Again, just run in, grab you. <laughs> yeah. That's just a testament to Bowser's ground speed. Like, like how many platform? characters can punish that with grab? Like, yes. a multi hit? I don't know. But here we are again, down throw back air. Not killing. Of course it doesn't. Honestly, feels like. Oh? Oh, yeah, the drag down, down there. Mm. Interesting. Yeah. That's not something I've seen before, but yeah, if that's a tool you have in your pocket and you're up a stock. Yeah, if you know, I mean, if you know that Nano Ash doesn't have a jump, yep. definitely go for it. Yep. Like, he's got nothing else. All right, but uh, game three now, some honestly good adaptation and yeah. better execution for Pokepen there in that in that game too. But on Nano Ash's counter pick, we know that a lot of the time it comes with, or like. Nano Ash's advantage and execution comes a lot of the time with just comfortability, and I think stage choice for him yeah. actually matters quite a bit. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. FD was the Nano Ash pick for this one. Yeah. Um, We're not going to see those platform extensions and combo extensions from Palutena here. It's just going to be coming down to stage control uh -huh. and making a simple game is what. Nano Ash likes, right? Oh, neutral air to forward air extension off of that? That was interesting. Yeah, I do get the sense that FD would mitigate a lot of Palutena's combos. Yeah. Okay, Nano Ash's mobility in the corner coming through again, not wanting to give up too much stage control. Yeah, okay, there's that up tilt. We haven't really seen that, but what? The back air just calling out the drift away. When your opponent's smart and doesn't want to air dodge, you can still call that out too. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Quote unquote, like being lazy in the air can lead to call outs like that. Exactly. But, I mean, you don't expect your opponent to be so aggressive sometimes. Right. Yep. Harry up the. It's a good. Mm -hmm. Yep. Poker Pendwich just with those landing aerials, just trying to keep his opponent from coming back through. Yeah, nice grab there, but. Oh! Get the eye in from Nano Ash, able to actually punish out a disadvantage there. That was clean. Nano Ash been really clean with the up B, like with punches here. Yeah, that's definitely been monumental this 
like slow but very nice accrual of damage on this deck and stock. Uh, Pokemon needs to see this one out. On this ledge shop would be a really nice place to take it too, but the patience oh. from Nano Ash. Wow. He had that grab lined up. It's just the dash grab put the hitbox too far in. Yeah. Something. And, and Nano Ash again, yeah. Taking the stock from that mistake too. <laughs> that MVP move, yeah. Nano Ash border. <laughs> it's just his move at this point. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> it's not the Bowser. Board. It's yeah, it's the Nano, Nano Ash border. Yep, that drop down. Right. And I think Nano Ash burned jump, so he had to recover high, but Pokemon not calling it out. Still gets away with the kill. Uh -huh. <laughs> Combo's coming through from Palutena. Okay. Yep. And Ash has yep. no jump. I would have loved to see like a, just a drop zone down here right there. Like he yeah. could have gone for it. Yeah. Oh! Okay. Poker that would have been a good chance too. Poker Pen's exhibiting really good control right now. This ledge trap looks good. Yeah. This is like a time where you can just kill. Like, was Nano Ash at zero at the other end of the stage? I honestly think so. Full yeah. advantage state started. I was trying to recall. But... Uh huh. All right, good Ooh. mash, mash out, down smash. Down smash Wild. Right trying to end that stock right there. Yeah, Poker Pen just put themselves in a really good position now. They can take this stock. Man, that just feels so true against how big Bowser is, maybe. Yes. Like, maybe DI just doesn't matter with a big body. Yeah. Nice. Tomahawk grab. Not yeah. working out, though. Just missing the range just a bit. Bro. Oh, catches Ooh. the jump. Bad situation yeah. for Bowser. Yeah. Dang, Pokepen took that just in that entire shot. It was like, well. Yeah. Fielding through the up okay. More combos here. Pokepen has made some kind of adjustment that is slowly bringing the game back for him. Yeah, and this is the percent combo yep. prize that we need to see from Pokepen. Good jump away, though, from Nano Ash. Uh -huh. Really Nano. is only one one good tool to get out of that one. Yeah, if I'm Nano Ash, I'm slowing it away down now going, okay, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. I need to not I need to not let this run away. This mm -hmm. Yeah, this... It's essentially almost two stocks in a row now that Pokemon yep. playing really, really clean. Yep. Oh, what? what the? <laughs> no, when it takes it. Oh, Pokemon rolls their eyes. Yeah. Just no. Like, oh. Yeah. It's a nice, it's a nice two stock comeback you've got there. But have you forgotten about <laughs> the forward air? Nano Ash is always ready. I always only, ready. I only need one forward air, bro. Jeez. <laughs> and it's over for you. <laughs> oh my gosh. But close sets are exciting to see, especially yeah. when we're this far in the bracket. Yeah. We want some good, contestable games and winners' finals, and that's exactly what we're seeing from these two. Going back to Final Destination. Yep. Interesting. Yeah. That's Nano Ash. Nano Ash's counterpick. No. No, oh, Pokepen Poke brought it back. For God's forgetting who just won the last yeah. game. I mean, all of the momentum was in Pokepen's favor prior. True. So, I mean, if that they can keep it up. Makes perfect sense if you just, like, we're dominantly winning except for the last move. Yeah. Why would you not want to go back? Um, we're seeing counter adaptation come through right now. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> this stock's crazy. Yeah. Yep. Oh, and I, gets the two frame. I was about to call it right before it happened. The F tilt. Yeah, the F tilt frame. Uh, trap right there. Uh oh. But now. Oh. I was. Yeah, wanting. I've to been go, waiting. <laughs> wanting to go for the down. I've been waiting for the spike. Yeah. And he misses it the one time. Dang it. Oh no! Oh no! Way. No! That's the right call for Nano Ash. And another huge eye roll from Pikey Pen. Yeah. Is this how it's gonna that's, end? That's the sort of move that starts to tilt you. Just some effective cheese going yep. down here. Exactly, and you save it oh, for when it. Oh, down there! Come on, please. Yeah, and you save the cheese for when it really matters the most too. You yeah. know. Yeah. Okay. Pen seeing if they can get something started though. They were in this position last game when they all Honestly, won it. yeah, very, very reminiscent. Yeah. Yep, back throw. Stage right. control. Keep it dialed in. Keep these ledge traps clean. Don't let Nano Ash get out of the corner for free. <laughs> Nano Ash putting himself in. Jeez. <laughs> that was almost the game. Yep. <laughs> that up smash hits so hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Tomahawk's just not working out. Nano Ash will just dash away from those. He's not going to mess around with your pressure. Yeah. Yeah, Nano Ash is just doing the uh, the classic, like, don't try to... Whoa, that was an early stock, though. Yeah, Poker Pen taking that straight through. Oh, man! Good lord. It's... Staring your soul 